I was always interested on learning stuff, you know, and uh, I actually liked to do homework and uh, I was quite a nerd. <laughs> I am still. I remember when I was a child, I had this screwdriver that I would go around with uh, everywhere in my house. I screwed up the, I, I opened the TV and I fixed it, by the way, but <laughs> I also broke it. <laughs> and when I was in the university, my grandma uh, developed cancer. I discovered that there is radiation therapy and I had the chance to meet uh, with a professor that uh, helped me get in a scholarship to Italy and, and I ended up doing my PhD there. It was a lot of hardware work, so I had to go there and be with cables and, and, and screwdrivers and, and test, testing with radiation. So the turnover of my career was instead of coming home, I went to Varian <laughs> and, and I pursued the career in radiation therapy as I started. I had the chance to deal with people from the southern point of Africa to the northern part of Norway. And there you learn how people have different mentalities and how people think on the problems. It's just a matter of understanding how other people live, so you understand that not, not everybody thinks like you. The nice part of physics is that the language of talking is mathematics, and that is international. It doesn't have a nationality. <laughs>